hello good morning welcome back to another vlog tomorrow is indy's birthday so today we're just gonna be like doing her birthday gift and like her birthday cake and stuff because i want to make her birthday cake today no one knows i'm making a birthday cake i literally just decided this and now i'm gonna try and race and make it before she gets home if i don't get it done before she's home then i've got to tell her not to come upstairs until it's done because i'm gonna be putting like mini eggs all over top of it and just like covering it in mini eggs i got four of these mini boxes because we don't have any other of the big packets like we don't have one kg bags of mini eggs we don't have we have the other like there's like a bag of mini eggs but everywhere i looked sold out of them so we just got the boxes and we will make do. I got four. I'm not sure if that's too many or too little, but we will find out. All she asked for for her birthday was mini eggs. So that's what she's getting. And then I got her this mini eggs um, Easter bunny. And then this is the mini eggs Easter bunny. Some vanilla and some chocolate. So I'm deciding whether I make a marble cake and mix them together and have a giant cake or make one and then... We can have like different cakes for later. Or I literally just thought this right now. I could make a cake and then I could make like little cupcakes with little mini eggs on top. Oh my god, that would be so cute. Everything goes white. I can feel the breeze. Euphoric delight. of days later um like i'd say a good week later um i didn't film much at all didn't really do anything interesting neither am i today but i actually do tomorrow i have a job interview so i'm really nervous for that but i'm really really freaking excited for it because i really hope i get this job it'll be great because applying to jobs and trying to get jobs is hard so if i can get this one on the first go I'd be really freaking happy. So I'm hoping I get it. I was really surprised because I literally handed my CV in this morning and then they pretty much called me immediately. And I was like, is that like a good sign? I like, I think it's a good sign. I'm going to hope it's a good sign. Um, and then I'm going in for an interview tomorrow. They were going to get me in on Friday, but then they were like, let's see if we can do tomorrow instead. So I've never actually done a job interview before. So this is going to be new like i actually have to go in and talk to them so i don't know how my anxiety is gonna handle that but like it's whatever the job i used to have i i guess i can tell you where i work now can i tell you because i don't work there anymore i used to work at countdown or they're all worse now so when i applied for that job they did only did like i guess i guess it was like a phone interview because they called me and like asked me a couple questions like when are you available to work? And obviously I answered, I'm available whenever you need me. Because when they ask for extra shifts, you can say no. But if you say that, they're like, we want you. I did actually pick up heaps of extra shifts. Don't worry. I didn't just say that and like not do it. But so I did a phone interview. So I didn't have to actually go in and talk to them until my very, no, my induction, I think it's called. But now I have to go in and I'm very nervous for it. But I'm very excited because this will be something new. It's a big girl job full-time i started doing like some full-time when i was at countdown but i like wasn't like fully like i was contracted as a part-time when she called me this morning i think she liked me on the phone i don't know she was like i was like hi this is alicia and she was like oh hi so i think she was happy i like tried to be real happy on the phone i wanted to give off a good first impression so applying for jobs is scary but my anxiety is surprisingly doing well with this. I thought it would be a lot worse, but... I got this new, like, anxiety stuff that really helps. It's the, um, the Brave Face stuff. So now I have an uh, anti-anxiety station like Brett Cunningham on TikTok. I've only been using it for about a week, so I don't exactly have, like, a full, um, review, say. 
So far I really like it and daily like anxiety drops. I think it's called Cool Head. Those really help when I'm feeling really anxious because I can take those and it makes me feel a lot calm, which is what they're supposed to do. So that's good. I'm trying to hype myself up a bit with it because I know that I can do it. It's just a bit nerve wracking. And like, if I don't get the job, I don't get it. Like there'll be other jobs that come around, but it would be really nice if I got this one. By the time this is up, I will know whether I have the job or whether I don't, so. I also think I'm gonna cut down on how many new vlogs I post because especially now with this new job, knock on wood I really want it I think I'm gonna start posting every like one day a week on like Fridays or Saturdays I think maybe Sundays I don't know I'm gonna start trialing it out and see how I like it by the time this is up I will have obviously already started trialing this out I want to stay consistent with my vlogs because it's just nice if I'm consistent it's nice for you guys if I'm consistent too because then you know when a vlog's coming out instead of wondering which I know some of you do but some of you might not care, so. Also with this job, my shifts will be very consistent. They will always be the same, like no matter what. So it'll be nice because obviously at Countdown you do like shifts. Like sometimes I'd be doing like four till eight or sometimes I'd be doing uh, seven till 12 or 10 till 6.30. So it'll be nice to have something a bit more consistent and it'll be like easier to plan things around because sometimes like I didn't know when I was going to be working that week because I'd just like pick up shifts as they came up so it'll be nice to have something more consistent I'm not even going out anywhere today well I don't plan to I might but I don't have any plans to at this current stage um but I'm just doing my makeup because it feels fun to do my makeup and I like trialing things out. The one thing I want to start doing is um, eyeshadow because I don't do eyeshadow but I kind of want to. I feel like it would be cool. One thing I guess I'm a little bit excited about with this job is that if I get it, I get to go clothes shopping because the clothes I have are not very like professional clothes. Like I guess some of them could be but I probably need something a bit better. Maybe this weekend. I can go do some clothes shopping. On top of that, I need new glasses anyway. So I don't know what this eyebrow gel does because everyone uses it to like make their eyebrows stick up, but mine don't really want to do that. So I feel like I just look, I don't know. I'm just putting product on my eyebrows. But anyway, this setting spray by the way, works like freaking magic. It smells so good too. The lady on the phone seemed really nice, so I'm hoping she is really nice. I mean, she should be. Yeah, I'm going to see her tomorrow. She's interviewing me. I'm quite nervous, but I'm also excited. I don't know. I feel like this is a good opportunity for me. So, I put the heaters on because it got quite cold in here. That should not be over the vents. Yesterday, while I was chilling out here, I was like coloring in my book and watching Baby Reindeer on the TV. Look at the setup. Can you tell we like plants in this household? So yeah, we're, I was watching Baby Reindeer on the TV and then coloring in my coloring book. It's not great, but this is what I have so far. I've been coloring in the tree. That's the most fun to do. Oh, the cat wants outside. There you go. Have fun. But yesterday I also made some wheat bix slice. And now, if you've never had wheat bix slice, it's so freaking good. You should definitely try it. It's got wheat bix and then chocolate icing, and like it's really good. Do you even have wheat bix in other countries? That might be a really dumb question, but wheat bix slice is really good, and I do highly, highly recommend. It's also a very beautiful sunny day today, so I might get outside and do something. This house is very quiet because I've been here by myself lately, which has been nice, but yeah. I'm definitely ready for a big girl job. I'm ready to get back and like talking to people because I feel lonely here because like obviously everyone else is like at school or work. So I'm here by myself, there's not really a whole lot I can do. And I would go shopping, but I'm kind of broke. So um we don't we won't do that, but yeah.